Oi, gente! Hello, everyone! My name is Maite, and I'm here to teach you all about Brazilian Portuguese. In this video, I'm going to talk about the expression da sopa. Da sopa. It's mostly used in the gerund form, dando sopa. Dando sopa. I live in New York City, and I just came back from Orlando. I was at the airport with one of my best friends, and I used this expression with her. We got to the airport super early and we were there sitting down by the gate waiting to board our flight, doing nothing, you know. We weren't hungry, hungry, but we saw a bunch of Doritos bags left um, unattended in a tray on the boarding desk, literally like four or five meters away from us. We looked at each other and we went like, Shall we go get one? I could totally eat a bag of Doritos right now. Then I told her, Ah, tá ali dando sopa. Acho que não tem problema se a gente pegar um. Tá ali dando sopa. Acho que não tem problema se a gente pegar um. Which means, well, it's there, dando sopa. I don't think it's a problem if we go get one. That being said, I hope you already have an idea of what dar sopa means. It's mostly used when someone is inattentive or indifferent or when something is left unattended. Okay, so for example, the Doritos bags were just there, unattended. So the bags were there, dando sopa, dando sopa. There is another saying in Brazilian Portuguese that goes like Dando sopa para o azar. Dando sopa para o azar. Which means that you are dando sopa to bad luck. Someone can say that to you when you're being silly, doing something stupid or being unattentive. Meaning that something can go wrong and that you are taking risks. Another example, whenever it's nighttime here in New York City and I have to walk home by myself, I do it fast, right? I don't look at my phone, I don't listen to music, I stay alert and I pay attention at my surroundings. So, in Brazilian Portuguese, I could say, Eu saí do trabalho tarde e fui para casa rápido. Não fiquei na rua dando sopa. Eu saí do trabalho tarde e fui para casa rápido. Não fiquei na rua dando sopa. I finished work late and um, I went home quickly. I didn't stay on the streets dando sopa. I didn't stay on the streets taking risks and being an easy target. If you are wondering, the actual meaning of dando sopa is giving soup. Giving soup. Soup. But in this case, we should not translate it literally, okay? Well, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, click on the like button, share it with your friends and family, and don't forget to subscribe. You can also find my other social media down in the description below. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Vejo vocês no próximo vídeo. Tchau!